Oh, there's something behind those. Bruh. I can't believe it. Another Wobox! Hey guys, welcome back to My Singing Monsters. They just released a new update with a bunch of new monsters in it. So let's take a look at the trailer first. It's called Daydream Believer Official Oasis Mythical Trailer. Hmm, Oasis Mythical. Fistemba! What? Oh my. I know those are. Those are some costumes, guys. Oh, snap. Is that. Did Glowl just. fly away? Did, really? Are you. Can we see that again? Come on, go! <laughs> hmm. Someone's got an idea. Oh yeah, oh yeah, because of course everyone would just come running if you're gobbly, 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 gobbly. I'd go the other way, okay? But at least it's not a dipster behind this podium. Am I right, guys? I cannot believe the gobbly gore just said that. Was that even legal? Guys, I'm just gonna pretend I know what's going on here, okay? That is so ugly. You are so ugly, Kana. <laughs> what is... Oh, dear. I have a feeling it's gonna gobbly gobbly ga all the way to the ground again. Oh. Hey, I was right. <laughs> Dude, stop. I don't know if you guys are gonna pull this off. I don't think you can make the gobbly gourd fly. Okay, it wasn't meant to be. I don't see Pango getting all upset because he can't fly, guys. Why did a gobbly gore gotta be like this? Yeet the gobbly gourd! Um, really, so, so close. Alexa, play Despacito. Oh, there's something behind those. Bruh, I can't believe it. Another Wobox! Oh, right. Hey, would you look at that? This really reminds me of the Learn to Fly game series. Oh. What was that, guys? What the heck was that? It's beautiful. <laughs> okay, that was a bra moment. Now what is happening? Oh, the birds are flying around your head because you got hit so hard. Wait, but what? Is that Halloween decorations? Was that pumpkin? Wait, oh my god. Man, Gobbly Court's having a good day, guys. Gobbly Gord's having a really good day. He's peeping on somebody now. Yeah. Yeah, people don't like it when you do that, Gobbly Gord. Guys, Gobbly Gord is one problematic monster, okay? Oh. 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 The Trouble! Designed by ultimate creator, Eric Baberg, Burgett, Berg, Burgetts, something. Okay, so as you can see guys, there's a couple of new things in this game. There's a new Wubox and there's a new Mythical, but that's not all, okay? Let's take a look here in the old mailbox. Okay, first of all, it's Feast Ember. We've got the Gobbly Gourd. I think I've already got Gobbly Gourd on all those islands, so we're good there. And we've got the Trouble. The Fire Oasis Mythical. And obviously, you've kind of already heard it. It sounds pretty good. Also got, oh, what? That's a Glowl? I didn't realize that was even a Glowl, guys. I thought it was a completely new monster. That is the coolest Glowl skin ever. 
I know there's not a lot of Glowl skins, but this is one of the coolest monster skins ever. It looks like a completely different monster. Okay, I want that. Here's the Wubox, which is available on Firehaven, but that's not all. There is another monster, Schlep. A new Dream Mythical available to buy or breed at level 12. So I'm assuming it's going to be the, uh, uh, the what's it called? Cherubble. The Cherubble and the Catalyst should make Schlep. I'm pretty sure Schlep is a slang word that means like to, to trudge or trek or something like that. Schlep. To haul or carry something heavy or awkward or to go or move reluctantly or with effort. So I was kind of right because, you know, if you're trudging or trekking, it's, it's not an easy task, right? So, yeah. I would have preferred not to schlep all the way over there to run an errand. Okay, so I don't know if that has anything to do with the new schlep, but I just wanted to point that out. So guys, aside from this update, there is one other thing I need to do. It was a previous update that I didn't get to yet. It's a new monster on Amber Island, one that I've never seen before. Oh, and also guys, I finally put some uh, relics into clearing out my Amber Island. Look at all this space. One of these days, I'm gonna get all the monsters here. Introducing the Bisonorus, or is it the Bisonorus? I'm not really sure, but it's a new monster on Amber Island. It looks pretty cute, guys. I like the I like it when monsters are two monsters, you know, like uh, Bon Appetit. Now, I've actually already got this guy ready to go. His name is Hornslow. And we're gonna incubate him. Introducing the Bisonorous. I think that's what I'm gonna call it, guys. Oh, okay. I think I'm gonna call it Bisonorous. You know, it, it, it sounds good. So it's two horned creatures. One is a big, round, fat dude, and the other one is a, a little one eyed, cat sized thing. I'm kind of wondering are, are both of these guys gonna make noise or just one? Oh, what? Oh, he's kind of doing like an echo for him. Oh, that's cool. I also have to uh, breed a rare Snizer, I believe. Uh, how many relics do I have? I don't know, enough. Enough to do this, enough to fail. Wait, that doesn't look like a fail to me. That's a two day incubation. 53 diamonds, no way, that's a fail. Ho oh, ho, okay. I hate unfurling flags, guys. So it's great that we don't have to do it. All right. I will say, guys, I do like the rare Snizer more than the common Snizer. Okay, now we need to read the description on this uh, new monster that we got here, guys. It takes two to tango. And in this case, it takes two to sing as well. Together, since birth, these fire monsters have a great knack for communication, usually one telling the other what to do. With the diminutive Emperor Bisonorus atop the burly standard Bisonorus. The, what? They're two of the same thing? What? That's okay. Except that one time when the latter had to crisis manage the former's dignity after an unusual wardrobe malfunction involving some possibly imaginary clothes. With each supporting the other, they always seem to have can two attitudes. You mean attitudes, right? So we got a tiny emperor and a burly standard bisonorous, and together they make the bisonorous. It sounds to me like this is actually a bi bisonorous because there's two of them. I don't know. Anyway, I do like the the little echo that the emperor does. Okay. All right, guys, next up, let's go to Fire Oasis and get the new mythical. I don't even know how to do this, man. Let me let me take a look. It should be in the uh, in the market, right? Oh, and the Epic Glowl. I need the Epic Glowl. Here's the uh, Cherubble, guys. Okay. Okay, here's something interesting, guys. So the Cherubble was designed by Eric the Cleric, who pledged for the ultimate creator experience in My Singing Monsters, the board game Kickstarter. Hmm. All right, guys, we're going to start off by trying to get the Cherubble. It's a Kongle and a Wallaby. Hmm. That ain't it. Whoop. There it is, the Cherubble. Oh, you're in Cherubble now. <laughs> okay. So it's a little harp. I mean, in a way, it's really similar to the Wallaby, but we needed a Wallaby in order to breed it, so that's cool. And it's funny because this guy is actually asleep. You know, not the muted sort of sleep that you can put a monster in, but a different kind. Isn't that strange? What do you mean upgrade the castle? 
I'll put you over with the Wallaby since you probably feel a little at home. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, there's these four little dudes, and they fly around, and they play the music. And the little, uh, little guy here, his name is Dreamble. He don't, he don't do nothing, man. So what happens if you actually mute this thing? Now they all sleep. What? No, wait, what? No, now you're awake? <laughs> That's funny. So, so if you mute the Cherubble, it wakes up. Oh. So you're actually playing with the Wallabies. Hmm. This is nice, but it's kind of getting drowned out. Ah! Hmm. You know what this kind of reminds me of? The music in Balloons TD6. Am I alone? Okay. Good job, guys! Good job! You want to go somewhere else? If we want to get this guy to Mythical Island, we have to actually teleport him to Mythical Island. So, uh, see you later, dude. I'll just have to breed another one while he's still available. Hey yo, check it out! <laughs> I have so many of these guys, man. I gotta get rid of some of my good jubes. I just didn't really want to throw them out, you know what I mean? But they, they're taking up space, I'm gonna need some of that space. Oh man, why haven't I done this yet, guys? What's my deal? I came to this island, I didn't take like two seconds to throw some money at it. It's not like it costs relics like Amber Island. Let's see how this thing sounds on Mythical Island, folks. I'm gonna, I'm gonna place it off by itself so we can hear it good. Okay, do you wanna go up here? I'm gonna go up there. Guys, I don't like that the animation on this thing jumps. It's like a jump cut in the animation. This needs to be fixed. See? Not good. Not good. Oh. Oh. That's very dreamy. Okay. I've I mean, of course it's dreamy. The dude's asleep. This is the straightforward part because, you know, there's not a lot of guesswork when there's only one monster you can breed with the other monsters. Uh, we just need to breed our catalyst with our Cherubble and we'll hope to get something good. It's a Cherubble. I don't want no Cherubble, man. Okay. <laughs> I want, I want to schlep. 21 diamonds, that's the one, right? Yeah, the schlep. Looks like a bowl of Lucky Charms. Is that what this monster is? A Lucky Charms mascot? Mmm. I too like to save all the marshmallows for the end. But where's the milk? Guys, I gotta say, this is a disgusting monster, okay? I don't know how else to put it. Look at, look at the mouth on this thing. I don't like it at all. This belongs on Light Island because Light Island is gross. Okay, yeah, look at that beautiful flying uh, vat of Lucky Charms. This is uh, this is what I wanted for sure. All right, welcome schlep. Okay, so this thing just kind of I, I don't I don't even know. It's a, it's flapping its little wings, flying off the ground a little bit, and just making weird faces. It's all good. Can you make a good noise though? I'll forgive you for looking so bad if you make a good noise. Oh, oh, shake those lucky charms, baby. Shake them, shake them like your mama made them for you for breakfast. Yeah. <laughs> okay, percussion. It's not bad, guys, I mean. It adds a little bit to the song. You can't really hear it too well. Zoom back in. It is what it is. I want to know more about it though, okay? I want, I want to know why it looks so bad. For being such a wholesome looking monster itself, the Oasis Mythical must surely have some unusual dreams sometimes. So this is apparently a dream of the Cherubble. Cherubble? What the heck? That's the only reasonable explanation for the schlep. Drawn from an extravagant imagination and brought into being in the dream space. Maybe it's a warped manifestation of a blubberfly incited by erstwhile dreams for a little personal time? Some have proposed that the schlep is inspired by a memorable but noisy encounter with a denizen of the eclectically populated coral reefs of the living ocean. For better or worse, the listless, this listless dream mythical is now a permanent companion on Mythical Island, so best try to get along. Don't worry, I'm not after your lucky charms. Even though they are 
magically delicious. Hashtag not sponsored. Okay, you keep shaking it. I'm gonna get out of here and go back to Fire Oasis, where the fun has only just begun. Not really, we have we have one monster to get. Okay, we need a wink and we need a quibble. 19 diamonds! Look at that, folks, the epic glowel. Oh, she do be glowing, though. Woo! Mmm. This bird looks so, like, devious, you know? It looks like an enemy. I like that. I mean, look at this, guys. Compare the two glowels here. One of them looks a little more evil than the other. Well, I mean, you know what this thing sounds like. But I gotta say, it looks... it. it it's a little weird seeing it come out of the epic Glowl's mouth. Sporting bright complex colors, the common Glowl is mostly diurnal and prefers to fly by the light of the sun. By contrast, the epic Glowl, known in some circles by its other name, the Glorvid, <laughs> fully embraces the darkness. Though this raven-like monster has muted colors and fearsome features on the outside, epic Glowl's personality still shines brightly on the inside. Perhaps it's hybrid bird and bat wings help it to sympathize with the epic Tweedle? Soaring through the night sky, this fire epic is guaranteed to come gently rapping at your chamber door, causing your foot to start gently tapping on your chamber floor, all to make sure it doesn't miss out on any of the bountiful harvest. Quoth the epic glowl, give me more! Okay, well that's fun. Uh, so, yeah, they they said the same thing. Although it looks kind of evil, it's, it's a good a good monster on the inside. All right, guys, now let's go to Fire Haven. The last island on our list today, the big one. First of all, we need to get Epic Glowl again because Epic Glowl is epic. And of course, when I say Epic Glowl, you know I mean the Glorvid. We need to get the Glorvid. Okay, Flugel plus Dandy Doo. Okay, so I'm just trying to make a little bit of room so we can put our new Wubox in the middle of the uh, island. Which means I do have to do something with this guy. He's no longer the centerpiece. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. Okay, after a little arranging, here's what we got. Now, I just want to point out that my gobbly gourds are mostly muted. I will unmute them, even though they're going to be really loud. I'll unmute them because it's Thanksgiving, okay? And now, we are going to buy ourselves a freaking Wubox, man. A Wubox. 75 million bucks, guys. It's a good thing I got a lot of money here. You've unlocked the wall box. Look at that little box. So cute. Oh, hey, I'm level 42 now. I'm a floofy sitter. Well, hang on. I'm not a floofy sitter yet. I want to be a floofy sitter. All right, I'm a floofy sitter now. Let's take a look at this. I mean, I know what has to go in here. Every monster, every common. Uh, so I guess let's... I guess let's breed a bunch. I don't really want to get rid of anything here. Like, this is one of my best islands, guys. I keep talking about how, how I like how hard this island goes. And I'm pretty good on monsters here. I mean, mostly I can probably just do Tring and something else. I don't think that's going to give me any issue. Let's try and get a Reedling. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I got my first fail for a breeding, guys. And I need a Tring anyway, so that's not so bad. Uh... Wait, what? Oh, he's got a costume on. Right. Uh, uh, uh box it. <laughs> All right, guys, we got one monster left to put in this wall box and then we can wake him up. But first, I just want to quickly say something. And I'm only doing this because lately MSM has been blowing up on YouTube and my videos are getting a lot more attention. A lot of you are watching and aren't subscribed yet. So if you're one of those people, hit the sub button down below so you don't miss videos like this because I upload MSM every week. By the way, guys, I would also really appreciate it if you smash the like button on this video because I try and get these update videos out as fast as I can for you guys. Now, let's box the final monster. Boom. Hey, wall box. You want to wake up? You want to power up here, buddy? There he is. He looks so small. The wall box. Wow, I mean, he's no epic Wubox, or maybe even a rare Wubox. Rare Wubox is actually one of my favorite monsters in this game, guys. I just, I like the stuff that he says, even though it's mostly misheard lyrics. <laughs> All right, buddy, lay it down. Oh. I can barely hear it. Come on, man, make more noise. What the heck? 
I can't even like, I, it's very hard to put you off by yourself, man. I got no room for nothing. I can maybe move the nursery. Well guys, one thing I can say about this new Wubox is that he's not overwhelming, clearly, because I could barely hear him. Okay. He's not bad. Not, not the best Wubox I've heard, not the worst. There are a couple of wall boxes that I almost feel like they ruin the song. You know what I mean? So I'm okay with this. I'm okay with. It. I'm just now. I'm just waiting for the uh, the epic wall box. You know, they had to put the normal one here first. What do you guys think an epic wall box on this island would even be like? It would have to be made of fire or something. Like the Earth Island wall box is like a bunch of like digging tools. So I mean, this island is just candles. So I would expect there to be some flames on that guy. Well guys, there you have it. This is the new full song on Firehaven featuring the brand new Firehaven Wubox. Let me know what you think of them down below in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. And if you want to check out another one of my videos, you can check out this one right here. Like, like right there. Like, you could, you could click on it.